Okay, hello and welcome to this video. In this video, I want to talk about a Microsoft Teams error message and how I fixed it. I'm not sure if there are any other solutions to it. However, this worked for me. So yeah, I just want to show you what I did. Well, uh, I got this error message here uh, with a strange error code and uh, the provided authorization code or refresh token has expired due to inactivity. And I had no idea what to do. So I did a lot of Google research and what did not help me was reinstalling Microsoft Teams uh, or restarting the computer. The problem was still there. So I found a solution and this includes deleting several folders on your system. So let's get started. You can copy it from here, from our blog post. I'll put the link in the video description. Okay, first uh, we uh, look if Microsoft Teams is running. If yes, we close it. And if you have Microsoft Teams problems, uh, what you can do is um, you can uh, use teams.microsoft.com. You can log in there and you can use Microsoft Teams there. So on, if you have problems with Microsoft Teams, this is also a solution, a short time solution that you can use it in the browser. Okay, anyway, let's delete these folders here. You just copy the folder here and then you go to the Explorer and put it in here into the address bar go one folder up and then our folder here is still selected. Um, you delete this folder or uh, if you want to be more safe and you can just rename it underscore old, for example, then this folder is no longer used. It's the same as delete, uh, but the folder is still there if you are uh, not as courageous as I was uh, just deleting the folder. Okay, um, and then you go through the list here and to delete every folder here if it, if it exists. Um, okay, I missed one character here. So, so and then we delete the folder. If a folder cannot be deleted uh, and there's a file in, uh, in use in there, well, you double check if Microsoft Teams is running. If you still have problems, you go into the folder and just delete every folder or every file you can. So let's do the next one. This one here is not there. If a folder is not there, no problem. Just skip it. So the next one is this one here. Go one up, delete it. And the last one here. Okay, it's also not there. So just delete all the folders here which exist and then restart your computer and then you should be able to log in into microsoft teams again and the error message should not be there let's try this out okay after restarting now we start microsoft teams my teams here is in german but it doesn't matter so i will log in here and and here we are, the login should now be possible again. And if we have a look in our folders, we just have deleted them. Uh, they are recreated here after we restart Microsoft Teams. So I'm not sure what was the original problem or what caused the problem, but um, it lies within some files in these folders here. And once you have done that, well, Microsoft Teams should run again. Okay, well, that's it.